aisle. Kurt, this is a crazy story, and I don't know what I'm going to do when I see, when I'm driving down the highway, and I look over at an 18-wheeler, and there's nobody driving the big rig. But apparently, that there's now a company that's doing just that, right? When I worked in local news, I asked the traffic reporter, what have you learned about all your reporting of these accidents right. on the road? And she says to me, don't ever find yourself next to a big, big semi truck that's out of control. And I said, OK, yeah. the only thing to make that worse is to have no driver in it. And that is a very unsettling idea, which is actually coming true. Uh, driverless multi-ton big rigs are now uh, spinning alongside us. It's a reality in West Texas and eastern New Mexico and soon other highways in America. Uh, Kodiak Robotics behind there, so along with Atlas Energy Solutions. These are robo trucks. They are autonomous. In this case, they're hauling sand and have already successfully completed 100 plus hauls from this 42 mile, mile conveyor of sand that they, they mm -hmm. gather. And it's working, according to them. I don't want to drive next to it just yet. Prove that you don't get into accidents and run me over, and I'll be really good. <laughs> yeah. Okay. But as we look at this, it's not like it's out on Interstate uh, 95. It looks like it is a gravel road, and there's nobody around. So if you're going to work the bugs out, that's probably a good way to do it. Great place to work the bugs out, but you got to bet that it's going to end up on the paved streets yeah. in no time flat, and we'll be looking over, and there'll be nobody driving the truck.